All right. I'm not doing a whole lot with this game right now, but I could use some relaxing. Actually, I know what I can do. I'm gonna put some of this coal back though. That's not what I said. Okay. Let's see about trying to get up the uh, the new base. Wait, what? Why is the Langley inside of this? Oh, never mind. The Langley's so big it just looks like the platform at this, at this point. Alright. Chill out, computer. Time to go shopping. Do 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 do. Gotta wait for things to load. And then we're gonna do shopping. Alright, since my pen is having trouble writing, I'm just going to make a note to myself about it being 8.25pm when I switched games. As I think I've decided since Dual Universe is an online game, I'm just going to make it uh, snapshots in time. Especially since you know, I went around and looked at stuff. It can kind of be a historical... You know, historical video by the time it's released of what things looked like at that time. Do it a little different from our solo games. Okay, things are starting to load in. Oh wow, that's like my entire 
wheat. So I guess that's all I'm gonna get for now. Click, clock, click. I don't know, spicy rock, silly. Hoping I'd be able to fit one more thing in my pockets, but that is two out of the three things we came for, so. What are you talking about, Jug? An old spicy rock. So we're gonna have to make a second trip over here. But that's alright. to do some ship repairs too because uh, I accidentally came in too hot last time I I went so I, I completely blew out one of my smaller engines it still flies but I gotta get it re replaced for now I'm driving my little green goblin disc <laughs> There is no spicy rock, you goober. Rawr. All right, seat. Any day, any day now. Yeah, that's why I didn't bring the Sun Cruiser. I was mostly uh, calibrating mines and just grabbing a few things. <sighs> Load my seat, please. Game. You'd think it would know to like load in your personal things before trying to load in everybody else. I would I would have thought they would do that, but apparently no. It doesn't seem to have good priority loading. There we go. Well, that's not the seat, but that's okay. This is still my favorite ship so far. So much easier to fly this thing.
Plus it can get, if I go up really high like this, it can go all the way to the 90 kilometers between the my base and Costco for only like 4% atmo fuel. <laughs> Super effective. Which basically means I could go back and forth like 25 times without worrying about it. It, it basically goes up so high that uh, it's at like 2% atmosphere, so it like automatically uh, slows down the engines because it knows that it can't they can't really work very well up here. And when it does that, it automatically uses less fuel. So I can just basically float like inches away from space and it's <laughs> it just saves everything <clears throat> and I don't have to worry about it getting hot because its max speed is like 950 ish so it, it can't actually get fast enough to start being on fire it's very very good I have my uncommon miner set up already too, but I do need to move everything to a large court pretty soon. Actually, just go ahead and raid somebody. It looks like because I didn't have a whole lot of interesting things to do on this anyway. Let me see who's on. But we will do more uh, of Dual Universe soon, anyway. I'm sure. But right now I need to just make my base. Anyway.